You gotta have the looks. You gotta have the hustle. You gotta have the talent. You can't you, just because you can rap don't mean you're marketable. So they can say I don't got this. They can say I don't got that. They can say whatever they want to. Say that Kiki sell, baby. Just cause I'm me. Just cause I don't got. You know how I many people inbox me, y'all? They be like, don't go get no BBL. Don't care what they say. I don't care what they say. I like you because you look like me. You hear me? Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. One on one. Yeah, we gonna talk. Let's get on that. Let's 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 get on that. Cause I'm so over it. Well, let me just. Okay, go so over it. No, we we want to mm -hmm. ask the question that the people want to know. Okay. I, I seen some posts and comments after you left here, and they po we posted a video of you. Mm -hmm. You was on on the come up OTCU mm -hmm. and with reality TV, and y'all were talking. And there were some things that came out in that interview, and I believe it was uh, uh, Nina Loretta, mm -hmm. and she, which she came on here, and I brought it up. You know, uh, Nina Loretta basically uh, she stand on the fact that she is, you know, what I mean, one of the one of the best rappers to do it and she is the and best writer. in Dallas. And, and writer. Right, her pen game is stupid. So why you wanna be for me? Just go get in the studio and, and and make a better song than me. Go harder than me. If you feel like you're better than me, it's a friendly competition. No, I get it. Like if you feel like you, if you know you hard, go show me you harder than me. But right now I feel like can't nobody go harder than me. And I'm and I got the music to back it up. I got the pen game to back it up. So I'm I'm saying it, that. at the end of the day, you know, um even she said that she basically wanted to do a song. She said that in the, in, in the comments, but nobody responded. South Dallas Kiki. Nobody said nothing when she said she wanted to. She'll do it in the music because she really ain't on the. She, I'm not with the beef like that, but we can do some bars. And you know, you would think that somebody who claimed Dallas so hard, oh they'll be God. willing to just step up and jump on the track with her. What's up with that? Let me talk. What's up? Cause I'm not no fake bitch. We just gonna be one honey. Nina know what she said in her interviews. Nina Nina talked about Dallas, about our rap scene being trash and all that. And at the end of the day, I am Dallas rap scene. I don't give a damn. If you come to Dallas right now, ask who coming up in the game, they gonna mention Sad Alley Kiki. So when you speak on Dallas rap scene, you're speaking on me. You're speaking on whoever in Dallas rap scene popping that shit right now. And as a female, there's really no other females that are pushing it like me that's popping that shit like me right now in Dallas. So as a female, I spoke on that. Ain't no niggas gonna need to speak to you. I'm gonna speak on it. That's just like, them my big, them my big brothers. I got it. You hear me? So we just gonna be 100. Nina got on there and said we was trash. So for you to come over here and try to rap in Dallas, why, why say that? You know what I mean? Even if that's how you feel, if that's how I feel about Houston females, I'm not finna go and rap economics and say this shit in Houston. Yeah, but she actually said that that wasn't even addressed to nobody in she Dallas. She said it was about an ABC rapper, which she, she was getting into that girl. Why even bring Dallas in any then? If it's about a motherfucker that's from Alabama, San Antonio, whatever, why even say Dallas? My whole thing was, and I wasn't even on it. It's not even a big deal. I just was asked about it and then I spoke on it. So motherfuckers feel like they supposed to shut you up. This is my hood. Ain't nobody finna shut me up. I said what I said. Stop speaking on Dallas. Nigga, you come over here to rap. Rap. You the hardest show them. Cause I, then I ain't taking my spotlight. I'm just gonna be 100. But I ain't feeling no hoe come over here and say what they wanna say about Dallas and I don't speak on it. And that's just what that is. I'm sad at a kiki. Wow. Look, it's Dallas in my rap name. You ain't gonna let somebody disrespect me? But say, they doing enough already, man. So anyways, she did reach out to work. Uh, well, she hit my manager, and he did let her know, you know what I'm saying, he gonna run it by me, and we can see. I checked her music out when he told me what I told him. I was with it. I was with it until Nina sat on the interview and said, um... You what? What she say? Uh, uh, y'all act like you. You be just act like y'all mean girls or something. Y'all don't want to work with nobody. When I try to reach out and work with y'all, y'all don't want to work. Uh, and y'all don't even have to look. You hoes need BBL. All these. She said that. Not me. I I was hit up by somebody else that told me she wanted to work. So when I went to check her out, this is what I see. You hear me? And I don't know if you was talking about me or what because I hadn't responded to you working with you yet. But that's how I took it. So I left it alone. I didn't go on the internet and say I'm beefing with her or nothing. I saw that and I left it alone because I'm grown. So if you feel like that, every time you turn around, you know what I'm saying? If you feel like I need a BBL or if I don't got the look, then bitch, why you want to work with me? No, she really actually said on here, she did talk about the BBL and the look matters. You gotta have the looks, you gotta have the hustle, you gotta have the talent. You can't, you, just because you can rap don't mean you're marketable. Like, this is a young generation. The the this is the young people run, running the music shit right now. So, 
you might can rap, but can you grab the attention of the younger crowd? Can you make marketable music? Are you marketable? But she did say she wanted to get on that track with you and basically Cause I'm hot baby no, child no, 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 I put that together saying who the hardest rapper cause y'all both saying y'all can rap harder than each other who I ain't got I'm, listen I don't have she a, said I she the hardest I you don't say curl the I don't curl about another female well who the hardest who curls who curls if you if you got all the marketing you say you got Bitch, why you ain't blue yet? And I'ma just talk fat ass. Y'all talk this boss talk. I'ma just talk. Y'all block the cuss words out. This is me. So if if you got all this, why you ain't blue yet? I'm a hustler. I get this shit day in and day out. That's why I don't post every day. I'm in the hood. I really got real life stuff going on. I really do real life stuff. So no, I'm not posting every day. No, but when I do what I do, I turn the internet up. I turn them up. So they can say I don't got this. They can say I don't got that. They can say whatever they want to. Say that Kiki sell, baby. Just cause I'm me. Just cause I don't got. You know how I many people inbox me, y'all? They be like, don't go get no BBL. Don't care what they say. I don't care what they say. I like you because you look like me. You hear me? You, I don't got no. I'm, I'm, yeah. Man, say, I would never. I wouldn't say. I'm a win out being me. That's what they don't, that's what they feel to realize. Niggas tired of looking at the, the females looking the same. They tired of hearing them talk about booty. They tired of, I'm a win because I'm me. I don't talk about none of that. We have, pull a song up right now that I said something about, about my cat and I'll give you a band. I promise you. Well, first of all, it's going to take more saying. than a band for me to look. I'm just I'm saying, what I'm saying is, pull a song up. What I'm talking about my cat and I'll give you a band. Ten bands and I, and, and I, and I, and I ain't I losing. Say, I say it because I'm me. No, that's, that's my point. And that's they real. and they hate that. So when you think about just um the Dallas scene and, and, and basically the way that, you know, the females uh are rapping that you have seen, and we ain't gotta say no names, do you see anybody that's out there that's really making waves? <clears throat> who do you who do you see that you like this 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 uh or, or is is Dallas Trash like uh, Nina Loretta said, or, or what is going on? Yeah, out nah, here? I don't give a damn if don't nobody else decide to rap. Dallas ain't trash because they got me. You hear me? They had three. We lost three. You hear me? Dallas ain't never been trash. We got a lot of talent. We still got Seven the Great. He don't rap. He come out one one hit a year. Just like Cardi B. Shout out to and, Seven and the he Great. Blow, I won't say it. Shout out to Seven, seven the Great. Hey, right now we got Montana Seven Hundred Zillionaire. They're blowing up the map. Montana so, I've been hearing so, a lot about them. They can quit speaking Montana on Dallas being trash. <laughs> and bi and di billionaire at the door. What? I heard about these guys. So that hood nigga. He don't even got a chain on in his video. That's when you know these niggas really out here hustling trying to get their money. They don't even got a chick. And look at number one on Spotify. Stop saying Dallas is trash, man. Wow. That shit be peace of That is crazy. <laughs> Ain't it crazy? Stop saying we trash, man. Wow. We just, it, it niggas out here, they, they, they really can roll over and rap right now and they'll make it. They just don't be want to put in the work. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk.